Hello everyone, it's Cam the Old Giraffe with a Modern Warfare 3 gameplay commentary, and today we'll be playing some Infected on the Map Dome with the Striker. Uh, this is Infected, I think I already said that, but you know, we have Striker and RPG Secondary, <clears throat> so it's going to be a ton of fun. Anyway, getting into the topic of this commentary, <coughs> excuse me, I'm getting into the topic of this commentary, it's probably gonna be, like, the title's probably gonna be Road to 1K, or Drive to 1K, or 1K Drive, something like that along those lines. And you'll probably be like, what the heck does that title mean, Cam? And I'm gonna tell you what that title means, and it's kind of a goal of mine that I set a few days ago. I was kind of thinking about it a bit, and I'm kind of gonna put it into action now. So, my idea is, if you don't really follow networks, TGN has started making a lock-in. Like, so, once you sign with them... You're going to sign with them for a whole year, and you get three times the pay as a normal TGN partner, but, you know, you're stuck with them for a year. So, I shouldn't say stuck, I said, let's say you're with them for a year, you're signing with them for a year, and your network, I mean, sorry, channel is partnered with them for a year. So, it's three times the pay, but you're sticking with them for a year, you're agreeing to that. So, you know, lots of us are going to have to sign this contract in January, so it's going to be a big change for us, and... You know, some of us are, like, I know some people I'm talking to on Twitter, some people who kind of are with TGN, who, like, like TGN as a network, but don't really want to stick with them for a year, are big enough to transition over to Machinima, so that's what they are probably going to do at the end of December, probably January, early January. I'm not exactly sure when we have to sign this contract, but I think it's near January, so, you know, like, they don't really want to stick with TGN for a year, and I'm kind of in the same boat, like, I've been with TGN for about a year, and it seems they promise, like, a lot of growth. And uh, Even when you follow their guides, like, you know, I've kind of been doing that a bit. My growth didn't really change much, so... I don't know, that's just my opinion on what exactly has been happening. And I'm not really ready to sign a one-year contract with them. I've already been with them for a year, but, you know, I'm not quite sure how this TGN is going, because... It's kind of been ups and downs. There's quite, a, like, problems with their payments. Partner support, if you look on the forums, it's always full of questions and things that their partner supports aren't helping out sometimes like I had to wait probably a week till I could get a question answered that would probably take about three minutes to answer so you know it's not the greatest of support networks and there's definitely networks out there that are better for support so pretty much the bottom line is I have to sign this contract in January or I lose my partnership with TGN so seeing as I don't especially want to sign this contract with TGN uh, I know quite a few, yeah, quite a few people aren't going to sign it, as I've said before, but I don't, yeah, I don't really want to sign it. So then the other alternatives are to either <clears throat> lose my partnership and just go kind of networkless. There might be one network I could go into, but I don't really think I'd like to go with them because, you know, they're a really, really small network and I don't really know how they're going to work out exactly. So I don't think I'm going to go with them. I don't know exactly, yeah, everything is going to get handled. So... It's either pretty much lose my partnership and go networkless and just go by myself and try and make videos try and grow to machinima size and then hopefully get on machinima or do this this idea is the drive to 1k or the 1k drive whatever and try and get on machinima before I have to sign that TGN contract which you're probably thinking whoa whoa slow it down this is gonna be crazy and I know it's gonna be crazy if we started today I calculated out I'd need an average of 10 subscribers every day to get to my goal before January, so that would get me right around to 1,000 subscribers, and then I'd know the Machinima recruiters would probably take a look at my channel and might accept me for partnership, but that's a big might. I know some people who have 1,000 subscribers, I think they kind of look at people with 1,000 subscribers and over, or right around there. So like my channel right now, I've tweeted, them to a few, tweeted it to them a few times on Twitter. And I know they've probably looked at it, because I've sent them more than one tweet, I can guarantee you that. But less than probably 15. So, they probably look at my channel, at least if I was a recruiter, I'd probably do this, and say, you know, this guy is way too small for my cinema, he'll have to grow, and then, then we'll look at him later. So, that's what I, my goal is, and if you could help me out with that, that would be sweet. So, yeah, it's pretty much like, try and get 1,000 subscribers before January, before I have to sign that contract. Or... You know, like, the other alternative would be to lose my partnership. So, I don't really want that to happen either. Because, you know, partnership's pretty sweet. It's what people work for on YouTube. And it's definitely, like, well, the highlight of my YouTube so far. And it just means a lot. So, I think 
if you could help me out like that would be huge and I interact with my subscribers so it's not just like I don't look at my subscribers as a number I try and reply to all the comments so you know I'm not I'm I know it's sounding probably a bit selfish but I don't know I don't know how to make it sound more community like but I do enjoy acting with, like interacting with my subscribers I haven't really done an open lobby or anything like that but you know I play with them if they're on my friends list I'll play with them talk to them on Skype I help people out with stuff sorta of, so I don't look at this as just a number, I kind of look at it as, it as people who enjoy my videos and enjoy kind of hanging out with me and listening to what I like talking about and talking with me on Skype or whatever. So, you know, that's how I think of my subscribers as. And I think if, yeah, if I could get to 1,000 before January, that would be sweet. So I'll probably have, like, clicked the tweets in the description. If you feel like tweeting it to your friends or bigger YouTubers and trying to get a retweet or whatever, you know, that would be huge for me because... Like, one retweet from one bigger YouTuber with over 200,000 subscribers would basically pretty much do that if people enjoyed the shout out and enjoyed my content. So, thanks for watching. I'd really, really appreciate some help with this, and um, that's what my goal is going to try and be before January. So, thank you, and I will talk to you later in the next video. Goodbye.